Cartoons are every child's favorite, but there would be many of us adults who like to watch cartoons because our childhood is spent watching cartoons. But have you ever thought, that's how the cartoons that you have been seeing since childhood, how did they end? The ending of some of these cartoons is very shocking and emotional. So if you are a fan of cartoons then keep watching this video till the last without skipping it. Tom and Jerry is a cartoon that doesn't need any introduction. Because this cartoon has won not one, but seven Oscar awards, which are the most awards won by any cartoon. This show is also a very memorable show of our childhood. This is what we get to see throughout this show that Tom chases Jerry and tries to eat it, but Jerry always runs away from him and dodges him. The entire cartoon show itself has been full of comedy, but its ending was very emotional. The name of the last episode of Tom and Jerry is Blue Cat Blues, in which both of them reach the train track and commit suicide. But why did both of them do this? The cat that Tom liked went away with a wealthy cat. So his heart broke and he sat on the track. And the same thing happened with Jerry. So both of them sat close by and thus ended the episode. Pokemon is also one of the memorable cartoons of our childhood, in which we get to see so many amazing Pokemon. And there is a wonderful story to be seen. As we've seen since the beginning of the show, Ash's favorite Pokemon is Pikachu. And this also happens to be his first Pokemon. We get to see a very amazing bonding between Ash and Pikachu. And we got to see many such moments in this show when he saved Pikachu's life by risking his life. And something similar happened in the 2017 Pokemon movie I Choose You in which Ash gave his life while saving the life of Pikachu. And in this movie, Ash is shown to be killed. And many people see this shot and think that this is the end of Pokemon. And the photo you see in which Pikachu is seen crying is also a scene from the movie. But this was not the official ending of Pokemon as he has also been shown back to life in the same movie. And you will be surprised to know that in the entire series of Pokemon, Ash has been shown as dead six times, but he always comes back alive. But if we talk about the official ending, then no official ending of Pokemon has come to us yet. Herman is also one such anime that became very famous all over the world. The main hero of this anime is Mitsuo who is also described as the leader of his team. Mitsuo likes Sumire Hashino a lot, who is none other than his teammate Paco. But she never reveals her identity to anyone. But everything falls apart in Perman's ending. Well, its ending was not shown to us on television but we get to see it in comics. It has been shown in its ending that in the end, he becomes very sincere and does his work with a lot of sincerity. Due to this Birdman promotes him and Perman also becomes Birdman. And after that, he sends him to protect another planet. But when Mitsuo is about to leave his planet, Paco tells him her truth, after which Mitsuo leaves from there promising to return to Earth and does not return for many years. The story ahead of this has also been shown to us in Doraemon, in which Sumi Rei is shown while showing an episode of Future. In this episode, Miss Sumi Rei is wearing a locket and when Nobuda asks about that locket, Sumi Rei tells him that it is her friend's locket, who has gone out somewhere and she is waiting for him to come. Doraemon would be the favorite anime of many of us because this anime made our childhood. This anime shows the story of a lazy boy who is dependent on Doraemon for all his work, but seeing the ending of this anime, no one can believe it because its ending is shown very unexpectedly. In the last episode of this anime, Nobuda returns home after being beaten up by Jian, and he asks for a gadget from Doraemon. Then Doraemon does not respond and falls to the ground. Nobody gets scared seeing this. That's when he talks to Dormi in the future and she says that a very important part of Doraemon has been damaged, which is available only in the future. This is a type of battery that is not available at present. So he has two options to either Dormi come from future and help him but there is a danger of losing the memory of Doraemon. And the second option is to wait for the formation of that battery in the present itself. After this nobody changes completely. He studies diligently and after a few years, he also tops his high school. After this, 
a huge time gap is shown. After which, Nobuda and Shizuka also get married and Nobuda becomes the greatest scientist in the whole of Japan. And he would have made a battery from which the Doraemon could be cured. And when he installs the battery in Doraemon, Doraemon gets up and says the same thing. Did you complete your homework? This is where the episode ends. Which ending did you like most? Tell us in the comment box. If you like the video so hit like and subscribe to the channel.